kind of toothbrush should I use? People ask me that all the time. And no wonder you go into the drugstore and there are loads of options. Do you need a regular toothbrush? Or do you need a mechanical or electric type toothbrush? Well, first of all, let's talk about the bristles on a regular toothbrush. There's only one kind of toothbrush you should be using. Soft or even softer bristled toothbrushes. Medium toothbrushes and hard toothbrushes have no place in a human being's mouth. All they can do is damage. The place that you need to brush most is where the gum meets the tooth. If your toothbrush can't get under your gum, you're not fighting gum disease the way you should. So you really need to get a toothbrush that has bristles that gets under the gum line. And if you had a bristle that was hard, you would hurt the gum. Soft or even extra soft will get the job done. Plaque is sticky. It can be gotten off really easily if you get at it. And you can't get at it under the gum line with anything harder than a soft or extra soft bristle toothbrush. You should be replacing your toothbrush. If you're using a regular toothbrush, it should be replaced at least every two months. I don't own stock in any of the toothbrush companies, but what happens with a toothbrush after, you, after use is that the bristles get rough. And when they get rough, they, they can abrade the gum and they can abrade the tooth. We see people whose teeth have been worn away by improper toothbrushing and brushing with toothbrushes that are too old. So throw away that old brush and replace it on a regular basis. Now let's talk about mechanical or electric toothbrushes. Remember, you want to get at the gum or below the gum. That's the real problem, gum disease. So if we're going to brush to prevent gum disease, what kind of brush works well? Those brushes that move around in circles, round and round, do not get under the brush, under the gums that well. There's one mechanical or electric toothbrush that really works well, and that's the Sonicare toothbrush. Because the Sonicare toothbrush doesn't work by the bristles. What the bristles do is they generate sonic waves, and it's the sonic waves that break up and clean the plaque. And they break up and clean the plaque from between the teeth and under the gum line better than any other kind of toothbrush. So, I'm a big fan of Sonic, of Sonicare. Now, having said that, I don't like using Sonicare. It rattles my brain. And some people feel just like I do. They just don't like the sound and the vibration. And because of that, personally, I use a regular toothbrush. And of course, you can't clean your teeth between your teeth with a regular toothbrush. The only way to do that is with dental floss or, other, some, or some kind of other interdental cleaning device. And we'll talk about that later.